In today's video, I'm going to take a styrofoam bone and turn it into a solid aluminum bone. So I picked up these bones from the Dollar Tree. They're Halloween decorations. Now this is going to be a lost foam casting video. It's a metal casting technique. And it's probably the simplest way you can do any type of metal casting. So I need to do some preparation work before doing the metal cast. I have the piece of foam here and I need to glue onto it a sprue or a passageway for the molten metal to enter the bone. And for this, I'm going to be using a piece of polystyrene XPS foam and some Aline's Fast Grab Tacky Glue. After I've glued it, I like to coat it with a thin layer of joint compound that is mixed with water. The only purpose I use the joint compound for is to give it a better surface finish. You want to completely cover this entire piece of foam. The sprue does not need to be coated because we are going to be cutting off the sprue once it's all cast in solid metal. So after the entire piece has been coated, we are now going to let that set for 24 to 48 hours to completely dry. And once it's dry, it is then ready to be cast in solid metal. So it is a beautiful day outside today and it is now time to melt down some metal and turn this piece of foam into solid aluminum. So let's head into the garage. So I am not going to do a voiceover for this entire video. If you have any questions, definitely leave a comment below and I will do my best to answer it. But briefly, this is the lost foam casting process. I am burying this piece of foam in some dry sand. And yes, the foam has to be completely dry. You could probably see the dust coming out of the bucket from this sand on how dry it really is. So you bury the foam in the sand, you vibrate the container to really get a good compaction around the foam. And once it is filled all the way to the top, you put some pouring cups on the top. That is where you're going to be pouring the molten metal. And after this step is complete, it is then time to melt down some aluminum. 